Hey guys, welcome back. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys um, one of my favorite camera apps that you can find in the App Store. Um, today, I'm going to be talking about the app called Pudding Camera. Yeah, just like the food, it's spelled P U D D I N G. So if you come in here and you open this up, go to your Play Store and search Pudding Camera. It's right there. I have already have it installed, so I'm going to go ahead and open it up here. Um, this app is really cool. Um, it starts out like this. You can go here. It gives you all these different film um, effect options down here at the bottom. And right up here, you have all these different cameras you can select. Um, you go here. You got Snap. You got a panoramic uh, camera. Um, fantasy, fantasy, which is like um, a fake uh, depth of field um, camera. You got a four-shot camera, motion two times two. Uh, you got a vertical of the same thing, motion four. You have a fake fisheye lens camera, which is pretty cool. It's a lot of fun with pet pictures. Uh, you got a double, uh, and then you got your tri right there. But then also you got all these different film effects and stuff like that. I'm going to be showing you guys a bunch of, a little slideshow of a bunch of Apple pictures I took using this app. So basically you just pick whichever one you want. Um, pick your camera. You know, go up here. Uh, pick this one. And I got a little Apple here. So um, I'll go ahead and take a uh, picture here. If you guys can see that, um, hit that. It'll take one, two, three, and four. Yep. And it'll take four pictures like that, and then you can go right here and view your pictures. And it'll load it. And there you go. That's the picture I just took. So, and um, you can see quite a few different ones that I've taken. There's a fisheye, the four, that one again. Um, and then you can go back here and you can get into the different film effects. Like this is the, using the same camera, just different film effects. See, there's black and white, um, retro, um, a couple other ones here. Yeah. And it's really cool. And if you also download the app called Pudding.2, you can hit share and go up here to Pudding.2. And you can hit next. And you can add effects after effects. You can diff do different things. Like you can change the effect. If you didn't really like it, you can change it to something else here. And then just hit next. And it'll load it. And then you can share it right down here with Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, uh, and Flickr. So, and then you can write what were you listening to, uh, how are you feeling, where were you at. So I'll do a location, and it'll pop up and find my location through GPS through Verizon. And I'm at my apartment here. So I'll just hit select. Done. And then done up here. And it automatically posts it to my Pudding.2 account, my Flickr, my Tumblr, and my Facebook all at once. So, pretty, really easy to share your cool pics. It's kind of like um, Instagram, but I actually like this a little bit better. It gives you a little bit better um, adjustments. And it's more f for photographers instead of just a fun, a fun thing to play around with. Um, so, yep, yeah, that's my review of Pudding camera and um, if you guys have any questions just uh, put your little uh, comments down here at the bottom um, like the page uh, please subscribe um, and if you have any questions or any other apps you want me to review and show you a little bit more detail in uh, go ahead and send me a message and I'll do those for you guys so you guys have a great day have fun